what is up you guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is isabel and i would love it if you would subscribe in today's video i am back with a part three to i guess this like series i've been doing since the maybe mid-september where i pick a store and i pretend that i do not have a fall wardrobe i have zero pieces we're starting from scratch and i go through all the pieces that I would buy to create my dream fall wardrobe from this one particular store. I've done Dynamite, I've done Aritzia, and today, as you guys can tell by the title, I'm sure we are doing Abercrombie & Fitch. If you're interested in seeing the last two that I did, they will be linked down below for you guys. And as always, all of the items will also be linked down below. And without further ado, let's get right into it. Let's start with bottoms. Now. I have never been like a skirt girl before, but I am going out of my comfort zone and becoming a skirt girly and I am here for it. I love it. I love the feminine touch that it gives me. So there are quite a lot of skirts that we are going to be going through in this video, starting off with this black mini right here. I love this black mini. It looks so cute and it's also a skirt, which um, if you guys know, like I've mentioned this so many times in my past videos, I love a good skirt just because, especially with a mini skirt, you don't feel like you're always needing to pull the skirt down because you have the shorts underneath. And I really love a skirt where it's like the shorts are hidden under the skirt and not like showing at the back. That's just my personal preference. And this one is just like chef's kiss. So beautiful. Like literally you guys, I just wanted to like go on sale and I'm going to be purchasing it. I'm obsessed. It is so cute. The only skirt that I currently have is a linen skirt and that's just not the vibe for fall and winter. It's totally the vibe for spring and summer, just not fall and winter, you know? Staying in skirts because I did say there are a lot of skirts. I am actually obsessed with midi slash maxi denim skirts like this one right here with the slit at the front it has to have the slit at the front though i don't know how i feel about the ones that don't have the slit if, if that's what you like that is completely fine personally for me i do believe that i would need the slit at the front to make it work for myself and this one is so cute i think it is perfect because it's not super long so especially for like someone like me who's 5'4 short girl you know this is maybe a little bit better than the maxi skirt the only thing i will say is that if you go for a maxi skirt i feel like if you're wearing like ankle boots somewhat like ankle boots you know, like the longer sort of ankle boots like the ones i just got in my last video if you guys watch my vlog they feel like they don't look as good with a midi skirt but they would look so good with the maxi skirt maxi skirt if you're wearing the midi skirt i feel like that would look so good with um some sneakers for sure but like some knee-high boots so cute i feel like that would just be the perfect beautiful like outfit for me all right next skirt and you guys i hesitated so bad i almost put two different skirts in this video but i ultimately decided to go with this one right here it is a black mini leather skirt what i love about this is um that you can put a belt around it there's a button at the front and like a zipper and there's also like two little pockets which just adds so much detailing without adding much to the skirt does that make sense i just feel like it automatically looks more like i don't know more than just a black mini with nothing not that there's anything wrong with that i just love the like little details that they've added i feel like it just less is more you know i feel like those small little details that they added is just elevating the skirt so much more and i feel like it fits the vibe of so many more outfits when it's this particular style rather than just a black mini with like a zipper on the side or at the back i just feel like those are more like corporate job kind of girly obviously you can dress them down that's not what i'm saying i'm not saying you can't do that but i just feel like with this one it's just easier to dress down if that makes sense and just for the sake of it i'm going to show you guys the skirt that i hesitated with between this one and the other one and it's this black leather skirt it's like the same thing as the denim skirt with the slit at the front but just black leather the reason that i decided ultimately to go with the other one is i'm such a timeless piece of clothing time type of girl so i would rather the piece be like a timeless piece and i feel like if i have two of these kinds of skirts like i really don't feel that these skirts are timeless they're more of a trendy style so that's the only reason, but like impulsively, I would definitely get both of these leather skirts. 
I just think they're both so cute. I love the style of both of them. I don't know, I have like so many outfit ideas coming in mind, especially the leather skirt during winter. Like, how cute. Okay, and staying in bottoms, there's this pair of denim jeans that I think is absolutely stunning. It's kind of loose, sort of like, I guess like baggy, but just like in the bottom parts. I feel like this, this pair of jeans would still fit like pretty tight around the waist, thighs, but then being looser around like the bottom of your legs which i love the look of like the loose baggy jeans and i think this is a good mix between we're still keeping it sort of like tight but we got the baggy style there and i love that i also love the wash of this and then the last bottoms that i have are these flare leggings i'm a sucker for flare leggings they look so good they elevate what could be a simple outfit like instead of wearing tight leggings the flare leggings just add that little detail that you need to elevate your outfit and i'm just here for it i love it and i'm here for a black pair i just think like a black pair of leggings is just perfect i also don't have any black pants in this new hypothetical wardrobe so i do need a good pair of black pants or black bottoms which would be these ones 100 percent like i love these so much and then i've only got one dress that i've added to this um, because I feel like I have so many skirts that I don't necessarily need a lot of dresses And it is this dress right here. If you guys know me, you know I love the button-up vests for this fall. I think it looks so good And this is kind of going into that style but as a dress and it's like a midi mini length dress Which is totally my style and I love it so much I think this is so elegant but can also be like easily dressed down or dressed up and then moving on to coats jackets that kind of stuff first off I've got this puffer vest I love a good puffer vest and this one is kind of cropped I guess and I love the look of a cropped one personally I think it just looks so good I don't know it just gives like this sort of sporty look like if you're wearing the flared leggings with some Uggs and like a tight long sleeve shirt with this on top it just looks so good I love this kind of outfit for fall it is just perfect I love it love it love it and then next we've got this trench coat right here I love a good trench coat I don't personally own any at the moment because I just you know we just can't have everything in life but this one the color the length the detailing on it is absolutely perfect I love this so much this like just picture this outfit the black mini a white tee or like long sleeve shirt simple white long sleeve shirt this on top some black booties or knee-high boots like how cute does that look and then you can switch out like let's say you're going to school you can put this, some sambas on or like a white sneaker on and then if you're going out afterwards just switch your boots and you can like go out super easily and it looks so good and then last coat i guess i have it wasn't in the coats on the website but i would definitely wear this as a coat i don't think i would wear this like as a vest or like a sweater or anything like that it would really be more as a coat on like some warmer fall days i guess and it is this leather like shirt jacket black shirt jacket that they have i think this is such a cute style for fall and it pairs easily with so many different outfits so i just had to have something like this as another alternative for coats i feel like coats are just such a big accessory during fall and i'm here for it i love this one right here so cute love the style and such a timeless style as well okay moving on to tops i'm gonna start with this crew neck right here i love the color i'm such like a light girly i love light colors i love wearing like whites and beige and tan colors i just that is just my color palette and i love that it says banff on it so of course representing canada and banff it's such like a fall-ish winter destination so i just feel like this fits the whole vibe and i love a good crew neck you can never go wrong and you absolutely need one during the fall it is just so easy to throw over like this the flared leggings a pair of uggs and heading out the door like that's it i it's three p three pieces three items and I've put an outfit together. Like, how good? How good does that look? That is, like, the only 
crew neck that I have. Next I have these sweaters. If you like it, get it in a different color. The first color that I got is the black one. And yes, I'm a light color girly, but a good black sweater, you can never go wrong with that. Like imagine this with like the denim skirt and like a brown belt. That would look so good. And then some black boots. I love the idea of this outfit. It just... I can see it in my head and I'm like, it's beautiful. I love it. And then, like I said, if you like it, you get it in a different color. I love this one right here. So it's like the same style of sweater. And if you go on the website, it's under like the same shirt, like the same sweater. And then there's different colors, but there's also like different, I guess, textures to the shirts that you can select. And I just love this one. There was another cream color sweater, but I think this one is so much more me. And it's such a fall slash winter sweater so i needed this like cream color with like the different styles of like textures to it because it's just that that's just how it is i love this and like this with the black mini skirt black leather or black like mini skirt i feel like both would look so good or even with just a pair of denim this the denim some sambas or some uggs the trench coat on top there you go, you've got an outfit so easy. And then I've got some very basic long sleeve shirts. There's this black one right here, which of course a long black sleeve shirt is a necessity during fall and honestly during any season. And then if you like it, you get it in a different color. I picked out the white one as well because white, like a white long sleeve is just chef's kiss and this heathered gray as well if you like it get it in a different color that's just my motto i love it like when you find a piece that you love and they have it in different colors and it's more of like a basic piece why not just get it in all the different colors and then for a more fancy white shirt i've got this one right here with like the square like neckline i love the square neckline i feel like it elevates the shirt so much so i definitely needed to get one of these in my hypothetical new wardrobe and then i got i decided to pick it in black as well like abercrombie has such good pieces with such good color schemes that i feel like it's just easy to pick a piece and just get it in both colors because it just works in both colors so the cream and the black i feel like those are just perfect for a good like elevated outfit if that makes any sense and then next there's this shirt right here this like mesh black shirt that you would wear like a black bralette underneath i think you do like a tan bralette as well i just think the black bralette looks so good on the model in this picture and i feel like this is such a good going out piece for during the fall i love it i think it looks so cute and i feel like you could find so many different occasions to wear it too especially during the fall even during winter all right next is this turtleneck sweater in this tan color i love a good tan i love a good turtleneck and i think this just looks so good it's also not on the longer side it's more on the like not cropped but just shorter than if it was like longer that makes absolutely no sense it's more like a hip length kind of sweater and i feel like this is the perfect turtleneck to like tuck into a skirt or some denim and put like a belt to like elevate the look so definitely a yes i needed a good turtleneck and this one is just perfect it looks so cozy comfy and it looks thick as well so i had to add this in my list and then last but not least is this white mock turtleneck shirt i love a good like mock turtleneck shirt like this one that's not necessarily a big oversized sweater with a big turtleneck i love the look of this it's such a great way to have the full feel of a, of a shirt without having the big chunky sweater when it's a little bit warmer or when you're going to do something that you just don't want to be wearing that big chunky sweater in your neck so i love this and i feel like it dresses up so well and yeah i just had to add this they also have it in different colors black striped i think i would probably add the black one as well um but yeah this cream color is just like calling my name i love it i think it's so beautiful and yeah that was the last item in my list i really hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you did and let me know what other stores you would like me to do i feel like abercrombie aritzia especially aritzia and dynamite are like my go-to stores so i'm not exactly sure like which stores you guys would like to see and i know the aritzia video did really really well like i could almost do a second part to the aritzia but okay honestly 
If you guys want a second part to the dynamite video, I could definitely do that because they have so many new things in that I'm like, oh my god, I wish that was there when I did my first video because I would have added that in so quickly into my video. I could also do a full like accessory video if you guys are interested, like what kind of accessories you would need to have like the perfect capsule fall wardrobe, but like accessory side of wardrobe things, if that makes any sense, like shoes, scarves, hats. All of that kind of stuff. Anyways, I really hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. But I was my own soulmate. It's like I forgot I was fine. Let you treat me any kind of way. Now I'm free, you gotta celebrate. You couldn't see everything and stay.